Hi, it's Arista with Fitter First. I'm gonna show you the new and improved bongo board today. So basically, it's a really advanced tool for balance and stability. You're gonna place your one foot here, one foot here. Keep your core in the center and you can use it as a balance tool. There we go. It's a really cool tool for training and getting your stability going. You can do lots of directional things. I love it for using my core as well. You can place it in the middle for planking like this, engaging your core or really challenging your core like this. You can even do push-ups. Here's some other cool moves you can use on the bongo board. Placing in your foot in the center, keeping your core nice and tight, getting to the center, trying to get nice and low, balancing on one leg, breathing. If you lose your balance, just get back up and try again. Try to get the board in the center and getting into a low squat. You can also do some rotational things. It takes a lot of practice, but you gotta work at it. Because the bongo board is very challenging, you wanna be very careful you don't start off on the wrong foot. So when you're starting, you wanna put your most of your weight on the foot that is not by the bolster. If you put the foot here, you're liable to cause injury and it'll be really hard to start. So always start with the roller on the one side and your lead leg on this leg and then in through the balance. Okay, if you need a spotter, you can use a spotter, a friend or a family member to help you out at first and then we're rolling. So you're using the bongo, trying to train your core and your balance get that stability, try to stay in the center. And remember, it's gonna be really challenging when you first start it, but you just keep getting better and better. Woo! Bongo's a lot of fun. You should try it out at fitter1.com.